Well, hello everybody and welcome to this month's Arability TV. Good to see you all and our highlights for this week. I uh, caught up this week with Neil Tucker from the Built a Dream project and was delighted to see that the Zena is now on its wheels and has the major installations there. This is what happened when I spoke to Neil. So this is our Zen Air. What's it like being back building a dream? Well, it's marvellous. In fact, someone say it's riveting. Riveting, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, it's great to be back here. Yeah. Team again. Uh, lockdown hit us it's hard. Not even just in terms of the fact that we didn't see each other for many months, but the project was gathering a pace, and uh, our sponsor had donated a lot of money to build it, and all of a sudden, tools went down because of the lockdown. So we had to stop for a period of months. Uh, but now we're back at it with a full gusto. Um, the engine's on now. The um, working on the tailplane. The, uh, the avionics will be going in soon. Um, so we, we really are gathering ahead of steam now, and the goal will be to really to get it physically built by the end of the year. Excellent. And uh, yeah, you said the wheels are on and the engines on down that end. What what's left to do? Oh, good lord. So you might notice the wings are missing. They're quite vital for an aeroplane. In fact, the wings aren't missing. The They're down here. Yeah. So the wings have got to go on. The canopy's got to go on. The instrument panel's got to go in. Um, the seats are going to be fine. There's, there's a lot of work to do, but um, there's, there's, there's a wizened old gentleman I know who says that when, it's, uh, when the aircraft is physically built, that's half the work done. So there's, there's a lot of, lot of work to be done here. Excellent. Well, cheers for your time now. Thanks, Alvia. Thanks for all the sponsors for uh, the sponsoring the building. Appreciate the support. Neil Tucker there with Build a Dream. I'm um, definitely not going to get a job as a cameraman, but we'll uh, work on that for next time. Now, this week has seen a return to flying for many of our PPL holders and very, very regular flyers. Um, with many doing their checkouts ahead of this summer, I caught up with Mike Owen to see how his week was going as he returns to fly. Hi Mike, how are you? Hi Harvey, I'm fine, thank you. How have you found this week returning to flying? Well, it's been a good week, weather's been good, and most people have been surprisingly good. Oh, well, excellent. Most, most people, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Who hasn't? Well, we well, got our track now. I can't name names. Yeah. But, um, and how has it been for you? Yeah, good. Great. Yeah. yeah. Really good to see everyone coming back and enjoying themselves. Nice bit of flying. Weather's been good. So, uh, yeah, very good. Very pleased. And what about looking ahead to June? Are you excited to do yes. trial flights? Yeah, it's going to be really good. If we can get back to normal flying, it'll be superb. It will be. Yeah, so I still make sure the hoists are working properly. Excellent. And we can get the classroom full again. Yeah. So we can get everyone back to flying. So that'd be really good. That's what I'm yeah. talking about. Cool. Cheers, Mike. Okay. Excellent, Mike showing discretion there as I tried to uh, tempt him to take the mic. Um, if you are unsure of our rules of going back to flying, uh, please do visit our website or send from desk an email just to confirm. Um, we are still being uh, keeping safe as best as we can, so um, please do indeed to those guidelines uh, wherever possible. Right, uh, so it's time to finish up for today, but before I go, just a quick mention of next week's Inspirability 
with the scholarships for disabled people that's happening on the 21st of this month, so next Wednesday. Also, a uh, quick thank you to everyone who helped uh, put together the Alex Booker Inspirability, which happened a couple of weeks ago. It was fantastic. So if you get the chance, do go back and take a look at that. For more information on either our challenges, our wing walks, our running, or to raise money for everybody, or our armchair air show live with Big and Hill, uh, please look on our website or our social media. But as we head into the summer, there are very exciting times ahead for everybody. I look forward to speaking to you again next month. Goodbye.